Will Shiba Inu be a goal for the SEC? And the price of Shiba Inus has been cheaper in the last few days than it was in 2021 and what we are used to. I should tell you that it went up by millions of percent in May, but after that it went down a little bit. And then, from October to November of that same year, it started to move up to the bull market high of 8,800 points per coin. Now, the SEC in the United States is taking a big hit, not just on the Shiba Inu coin but on the business as a whole. And I see a lot of people asking on Twitter and YouTube if the SEC is suing the Shiba Inu coin, like they do with many other coins. And I want to focus on this question because the truth is that the Shiba Inu coin has not yet been called a security or sued. I think you should watch every second of this new video, which has a lot of useful information. It will clear up any questions about it. We talk about the latest news about Shiba Inus and the Bitcoin world in general on our channel. If you are watching one of our movies for the first time, we want to give you a warm welcome. You can make sure you never miss a movie by clicking the bell. We will say that this station is giving away 5 million Shiba Inu tokens. To get a chance to take part, just subscribe to the channel, like this video, and leave a message with the hashtag hash Shiba Inu. On June 15th, we'll find out who won. First of all, the piece how much would you make on $100 if Shiba Inu regains its all-time high? This article, which came out in the Crypto Basic on June 13, 2023, talks about how you could make money if the Shiba Inu cryptocurrency goes back up to its all-time high. The author starts by saying that the price of Shiba Inu has been lower than usual recently. However, he or she also says that the price went up a lot in May 2021. The story then looks at a possible situation in which Shiba Inu goes back to its all-time high and figures out how much a $100 investment could earn. The author gives some numbers and calculations to show how this could happen. It talks about the all-time high and how a $100 purchase at that time would have given you about 2.6 million Shiba Inu tokens. It then says that Shiba Inu could be worth around $98,420 if it reached its all-time high from where it is now. But the piece also points out that this is just a hypothetical situation and that many things could change the price and value of Shiba Inus in the future. It also talks about how volatile the cryptocurrency market is and how dealing in cryptocurrencies can be risky. Overall, the piece gives an analysis of how much money you could make if Shiba Inu goes back to its all-time high, but it also talks about how uncertain and risky the cryptocurrency market is. On the other hand, the SEC attack on cryptocurrencies. I don't think they will stop until all exchanges leave the US. When that happens, US people won't be able to buy or sell cryptocurrencies unless they go to a DeFi. Then, I think decentralized banking will happen as soon as all cryptocurrency exchanges in that country are destroyed. They don't want us to do well and get money. They don't want a decentralized banking system that could hurt their own. The Shiba Inu coin is a threat to them. I'm not going to name social media accounts for anything, but there are some answers out there that say the SEC never sued them. That's the truth. The agency hasn't called Shiba Inu a crypto or security yet, but their general statement says that only Bitcoin is seen as such. I don't think it will be long before they tag all of them. Bitcoin is also an investment, and the SEC should regulate it because they want to have control over it. Here's what's wrong. Some of these social media pages say that the SEC drama has nothing to do with Shiba ecosystem tokens. That couldn't be further from the truth. At this point, none of it is being called a security by the SEC. It doesn't mean that they won't be. It also doesn't mean that SEC cases won't hurt them at this point. The agency in question seems to be focusing on centralized exchanges, which means they're going after Coinbase and Binance because they're the stars in the field. Because of this, there will be a huge number of people leaving. People will sell their cryptocurrency because they're afraid they won't be able to get their money back. This is a real worry. Even if the SEC is completely wrong, costs will go up if they let investors leave these exchanges or persuade them to leave. These exchanges are already barely holding on, and their earnings have been going down for the last couple of years. They will go bankrupt if they can't pay their bills. If this happens, 
our cryptocurrencies kept on those exchanges will go through the same thing that happened to Vol Lager after years of lawsuits. We'll only have a small amount of the cryptocurrency we had left. Investors know this, which is why they are leaving these platforms or moving their money to DeFi wallets. It will keep this loop going and make it more likely that these exchanges will go out of business. And if you think the Shiba Inu coin will be fine after this, you are completely wrong. Shiba will be hurt by the trend of people leaving the cryptocurrency market as a whole. If demand for all tokens in the community goes down, the price of Shiba Inu coin and all other tokens will also go down. So it would be wrong to say that it has nothing to do with the SEC situation. We need to realize that this is a much bigger deal than what many people are saying right now. And we should know that this could change the way the coin market works for the next 10 years. If you think that this lawsuit will end quickly and in favor of the coin market because that is the right thing to do, you are right. We live in a broken world, which is sad. If you look at the lawsuit between the SEC and Ripple, you'll see that it's been going on for years and still hasn't ended. It gives up and gives in. It will go on for years, and unfortunately, the market for cryptocurrencies will fall during that time. Now, the good news is that they can't kill a decentralized asset, so they can't kill the Shiba Inu coin, but they can definitely hurt its value and demand. What do they want to do? They know they can't stop a decentralized coin, but they can stop you from wanting it, buying it, and having it. We're going through something very important, and that means you have to make a choice for yourself. Don't listen to me. Don't even bother to look at what Satoshi writes on Twitter. Don't pay attention to anyone but yourself. The money is yours. You work for it. You put it to work. And now you have to figure out what to do with it. So, I want to know what you guys think about all of this. Will you keep the Shiba Inu coin, or will you have to say goodbye to it? Tell us what you think in the area below for comments. So, this video has come to an end. Like the video and don't forget to subscribe if you liked it. This helps me a lot with how YouTube works. Also, show as many people as you can this movie. Let's tell everyone about this. If you are a real fan of cryptocurrency, you won't want to miss any of our information. We'll talk about the latest news that affects the whole neighborhood tomorrow.